Hi, this is Mary Flower, and I want to show you a book I just did. Now, the cool thing about this is uh, that I didn't cover this. This is an old, old book that had, um, it had uh, pictures like this, so it was probably during the 60s, with different tabs, and I changed it. I did, however, um, add these pieces, uh, this great big rickrack that I found at a thrift store. In fact, all of everything you see, I almost always find it at thrift stores. So that's the crazy part. So I added that, but the cover was just like you see it, which is an original cover, which I love. And uh, I want to do a quick flip through on this. I love the pages like this, but what I did was I covered the tab and kind of uh, put the, because the paper was sort of thin, I added the little um, reinforcements and colored them, kind of color coordinated it somewhat to go with it. And then I did a lot of sewing on the sides on those. So uh, these were already included, these envelopes, which I really like, which will be a really fun thing to put in. Um, I think they were for coupons and anything that was household. This is this was probably something about coupons or something. I'm not sure. But I really love these old envelopes. These are original with it, and I kept it. I took out some of the nonsensical stuff, and I just put in paper for journaling. And I'll just do a quick flip through on this. I added some... Uh, fabric uh, and sewing on some of the pages but this would make a great um, art journal for somebody or just a regular journal crazy journal for somebody and I'm probably am going to when I'm done here go put it on eBay and I'll probably uh, and I will uh, put a link to that and so as you can see, this was green, so I added the green reinforcements. And all you do is use a marker on it before you take them off and then put them on there. So I added more paper in between, more of the envelope. And you'll notice some of the pages have been sewn. Some are plain. But it was really fun because it was already a little binder. And so it was really fun to do and kind of easier than hand binding it. So each section has one of these, uh, one of these old envelopes, and some. This went with it. Looks like certificate of guarantee. It was actually with it. It had something to do with sewing, and so I'll include that in there. See, it's got green here, and and every page, like I said, has the some of the line paper and these cool envelopes. And this one's really a treasure. I almost wanted to keep this one for myself, but I think I'm going to start putting more things right on eBay with this. Isn't that one fun? Great. Look at it closer. Probably can't see the images that well, but they have that old flat, um, colorful look to them from the probably 60s. Oh, this one had something in it too. Some <laughs> an old, looks like some old, I'll leave it in there. It's kind of fun. You can use it, whatever. But what, what a fun treasure this was. And so all of these pages have a nice sewing on them more of the same back here but back here is one one um clear plastic um envelope that you can use and i sewed on it and i used some more of that wonderful big rickrack that i just love that kind of goes with that so uh, here's you can put stuff at the end here so anyway this is approximately Oh, six inches, eight inches, um, two and a half to three, two and a half inches, two to two and a half, right there. And this, everything in here is uh, repurposed and 
I just really like the way this looks. So if you want to look on eBay and cause this in probably by today, I will have that. If, if, if you don't see it by the time it gets on there, check back in a day and you'll see it. So give me a thumbs up, a comment. And if you haven't subscribed, please do that. And I will be doing more good giveaways when I find some really cool stuff to give away. So thank you.